Uh, welcome back to Best Car Fixes. Please subscribe, share, and like. Uh, today we are talking about Land Rover Range Rover Key. Uh, the customer brought one key like this, brand new, and he said he need to program it. Uh, his key is like this. You see the cuts is quite a little bit different. This this one here, the cut is like this. This is this is a fourth key, but I give you the example, one side cut. This is cut in the depth. So what I did is I get this blade, which is like this, and I took this one out, I put it in, and I tried to add the key, it fell. It fell a couple of times. No matter what I did, I was not able to do it. So what happened was, this key here, let me show you, this key here, new one, and this key here, even to change the blade from one to one, it's not easy to put it, you know, like it will not stay. It, it kind of different a little bit. But this key frequency and this key frequency are totally different. So if you have a car with a key like this, this remote, even though the shape look everything same, the reading inside are totally different. Just like unlock iPhone and lock uh, iPhone, like iPhone for AT and T and iPhone for T Mobile, they don't work together. You know, like one of them lock, one of them unlock. So they don't work for the car is from 2009, 2006 to 2009 using the same key like this but frequency are different. Also, this one, as soon as you program it, remote and the key work all together. You don't need to program the key and program the remote separately. This one, when you pro program it, you have to program the remote also separately. Like you're gonna push the lock and push the unlock. Three times you leave it and you push lock, it will take the programming. This is a quick information. Also, you cannot program this key if you do not have already working key. You must have a working key to add a key. I'm using Hotel uh, Maxi. Every time I go program, he say fail, but actually it's already programmed. You take it out, you're gonna see that the car is start. When you're programming those key, all key must be available. If not, you, whatever is not there will not be able to program again. So now I have two choices. If you have one like this and it's messed up, you can buy shell. This one is a shell. Okay. This is shell too. This is a shell, it's empty. When you change it, you can pop up this one, transfer all your stuff here, and then if you don't have no machine to cut it, just move the blade from here and transfer it to this one which i'm going to show you in a few so now we understand what's going on the first thing i need to do is i want this one here it doesn't work at all it's messed up so what i need to do i'm going to try to take the this blade and change it into one of those so stay with me i bought this piece here actually it's a uh, snap on have it and number is 116 116 is strong and it can go through here so let's go ahead and take advantage of this one this thing supposed to stay here I don't know why it's fell but if it's fell I will take it out it here so I'm not gonna lose it so we're gonna take this one I bought this piece long time ago and it have uh, pins and after you can hammer it in for some pins but not all the pins are the same size so be careful on that so I'm gonna take this one now okay let me move this one move this a little bit 
so it's a lot of different tools see what you have it and what you like i'm gonna put this one here move it a little bit back so that the pin gonna go inside that hole and tight as soon as you tight it you're gonna take a small hammer see here hopefully the camera okay it's good one time i like this one take it out this is not working so i'm going to put it there okay this is the one that is good This is in case you change the shell. I'm gonna show you in a few because we already fixed one. This is a key. Also the same thing. Company from company to company. There is stuff are different. So you're gonna get different results. So I'm gonna take this one. Mm. It doesn't wanna go in, that's the problem. You know? Sometimes some of them different from the others. play with it to go in that's where sometimes if it doesn't work just cut the old one and put it in some companies they don't go to another one <laughs> let me see yeah you see here is a flat it really flat and this one here is thicker so do you want to go and do anything on it yeah if it doesn't work the second option is put it back and program this one but that's idea <clears throat> let me see i see they have some of them here too but this is belong to them so this is easy to go in let me see it's easy to go in so what you need to do is you may have to clean this one a little bit so that can go inside easy and maybe when it's go inside also i noticed that here the the channel here is big a little wider so in order not to go into trouble just cut the key and transfer it I believe I have one key. I'm gonna bring it and do that one. Now, change the. If you remember, I have one here. I need to change this one here, and this is already a shell, empty shell. If you cannot, you have this piece here. You put it here this piece I bought it from a snap on and it will go out for you just be careful how you put them back
Let's go. To. So now I'm going to turn this one. One. Two. Hold it with. Be sure that, yeah, this have to come out. That's enough. Now I have a screw here, I'm going to put it in and I will take this or I will cut it. If you have a good machine, you just go uh, copy this one into the end of the work. I even have one here. Also, if you see, it looks like a bigger. Even the hole. I'm not going to risk with that one. I will cut those. I will cut this correctly. Uh, don't forget to put the screw. And this way it work. Remember this shell, I just make the fix the bottom lid this is a button I soldered it hopefully I give some information that it help please subscribe share and like and if you have any question feel free to ask and Thank you, Watson.